I'm back with a medium haul. Um, these are past kits from Studio Calico and Gossamer Blue. I will start with Studio Calico. So Studio Cal my Studio Calico package arrived today, a week after I ordered it. So I have three disappointments about the Studio Calico one. The first one is I ordered this on Saturday last week and it like I said it took a week to arrive and this package is coming from Kentucky and for some reason I keep looking at the tracking and they do not good do a good job on updating where your package is going for some reason so I was really disappointed that this took longer because the Gossamer blue one I ordered two days after the Studio Calico one and it arrived a lot earlier and the Gossamer Blue one comes from California and this one comes from Kentucky so it does it just doesn't make sense to me. So that's the first disappointment. So this is the box it comes in and it has this really neat Studio Calico tape or packaging tape and I already opened all the stuff but first Separate from the um, the kit that I bought, I did buy this um, stamp, and it was only two ninety nine on their sale clearance section, and it has the two thousand fifteen and goals for this year, top ten, top five, right now to do. I did, I do, I always will, and I love the size of these stamps, so it's really perfect for. Project Life or even for planners actually and I actually like how it comes in this little baggie I was really surprised so I thought that was really cute so like I said this was $2.99 and I believe they still have this on their shop and I will be using this for my Project Life on um, documenting the Philippines <clears throat> So onto the kit. This kit is called, this is the limited edition maker kit. And first I'll show you, okay, it says on their list that this is from the Dear Lizzie. Um, I don't know what collection, but this is my second disappointment. Um, one, they did not show any gold glitter whatsoever. It was only the confetti that I saw online and two the confetti online was a, the circle confettis but these confettis are square confettis so it just did not make sense to me why the one that I saw on the computer is totally different from what I'm holding now so I mean I admit I wasn't going to keep the confetti in the first place but still you expect to see what you're gonna get so I will be adding this to my 100 subscriber giveaway once I reach 100 subscribers so guys please 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 help me get more subscribers you know tell your relatives tell your scrapbooking friends <clears throat> so onto this really cute stamp this was like the number one thing I really was looking forward with because I love this creative in the script style and there's the little paintbrush there's the um, push pen the clothes pen and then there's a paint splatter and then there's this just happened made with love whoops in my story so this is really really cute can't wait to use this and then you get a small metallic red um, paper bow paper clip so that's pretty cute and then here are some wood veneers now I was looking forward to these two however I'm also disappointed in this I did not expect these wood veneer push pins to be this thin I mean it's really 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 thin now Here's one of these Studio Calico wood veneers you would buy at Joann's or whatnot. So, just to show you, to compare the thickness, 
like this is perfect for planners for those of you who are doing those you know decorating your planner because it's very thin it won't bulk up your planner compared to you know this wood veneer but I prefer the this thickness for my um, project life because it, it really gives it more dimension compared to a very thin wood veneer so the only these are just all push pins wood veneers I'm not gonna take them all out um, I think you get about like eight of them but that was one of my other disappointments that I, I... anyways <clears throat> so here are the navy hearts I they're okay these are the navy heart stickers and there's like yay happy nice okay and yes um, I probably won't be using these as much because I, for some reason, I just don't like, when it comes to hearts, I don't really like the navy blue for some reason. And then here is the very, I say lilac, it's probably more of a lilac. You might, it might come up pink on the screen, but it's more of like a purple lilac color. So these are the alphas, and then there's some numbers and some um, icons. And then here are the die cuts. They're stuck on you. I made this, cut it out, create, I love this cut and paste one, photograph, let's make a mess and make stuff. And then here is the vellum um, tape sheet, and you get six different kinds I love all of them <laughs> I, I love all of them um, I love the mint green I love the stars I love this gray and black um, fern leaves so I really really can't wait to use these and they're the only thing I don't really like about these is that it's really wide compared to like regular washi tapes but it's okay <clears throat> So here we're going to get into the 4x, or 3x4s and 4x6 cards. So I'll start off with the 3x4 cards. So this has a very different feel to it compared to like regular Project Life cards. Um, it has a very sheen feel or in look to it. So here is the stars. And then this one says results, score, notes. You are perfect. Today's adventure. And I know this has a 15, so I think oh, it's better to use this card for 2015. And then here's the cut and paste. And then this one says pin it. <clears throat> and then here is the four by six. Here's the yellow um, words. Like, hello, hey, hi, yes, okay. There's a back with the mint green. Love that. And I love this card. This one says, oh, wow, with the ferns around it. Here's the back. And then here's the last one. I like pretty things. And there's the back. So I bought this kit on Studio Calico for $9.99. Which isn't too bad for a small kit. But the next time, um, I'm going to be very wary of what I buy on that shop now. Because this is my first Studio Calico. And I love wood veneers, and but I don't want wood veneers that thin. <laughs> it's very, very thin. <clears throat> so we're going to go on to Gossamer Blue. And this is the... It'll be the past... Um, December 2015 kit. So it comes in this very elongated box compared to the November one I got. And I already unwrapped everything. So you get this roller stamp from Seven Paper from the Elliot collection. And this is what's on the Stamp, thank you for the, and then stars, gratitude, thankful for you, happy heart, autumn, family, giving thanks, sweater, weather, quoted, label, and this. Now, I'm kind of, conf I, I would not add this in December because this seems more to me as a 
Thanksgiving theme. So I would probably most likely use this in November um, Project Life layouts. So, the, and this is actually my very first roller stamp, so I'm pretty excited. And then here is seven paper um, alpha stickers. There's 144 of them. You get black and, you mean, I'm, excuse me. I thought I was going to burp, sorry. Um, <laughs> so you get white and you get black. And this is also from the Elliott um, collection. And then here is another seven paper. These are the mint green alpha puffy stickers. And you get 38 of them. And this is also from the same Elliott collection. Then you get the memorandum by Pink Paisley and it's all in gold puffy stickers. And there's 32 pieces. And then here you get a ephemera pack from Basic Gray. It's the B-side collection. And, and I really, really love the die cuts you get in this. Especially that cassette tape. I love that. So can't wait to use this. And then you get um, My Story by My Mind's Eye um, sticker sheet. And there's 21 stickers. And the thing is, like, this seems more of a birthday birthday theme, and it's very girly, very, you know, pinkish. Like, it reminds me of, like, February colors. So, I think I will save this for February instead of December because I did celebrate my birthday early in February when I was in the Philippines. So, I, I think this, is, this would be really, really perfect. And I have the perfect, um... Paper collection by DCWV Hot Pink that um, will go well with this. But I might have to mix it up a bit because I don't want it to be too girly on that layout, but that's for another time. <clears throat> so here are the cards. Now, like I said um, before, the color theme for the December kit, um, there's a lot of pinks and yellows. And it just reminds me of like Valentine's, so I think I would probably prefer to use these for the val or for February layout project life. So we'll start with the four by six, and here's the farewell 2015, hello 2016. I really love this. And what I also like is on the back, there's no 2016, 2015, so you can put your whatever year that is currently. Um, in <clears throat> and here is I live for moments like these here's the back and it's in pink and then this one has like a very like wrinkled paper effect design <clears throat> and then here's highlights and this side is has an empty year because on the other side it says 2015 so that's what I really like it's very versatile and then here's yes and then the three by four so here's December <clears throat> clink party love this photo and then here's this blue pattern there's a heart Here's cheers. Here's this pattern. Here's noteworthy, and this is a journal card. Highlights. Here's a circle pattern. Memorandum. Pattern. Um, black polka dots. And then I like this side with the pink background. There's this one. Here's these hearts. Love them. Really cute. Always never. And then notes. The grand adventure. 
there's this pattern. Here's I love these this color combo. This pattern. Here's love. See exactly like this is more of a Valentine thing. I mean, you can use it for any time of the year, but just the color combo itself, the pink and red just screams to me Valentine. So, that's when I'll be using it. And another love. So that is pretty much it for um, this haul video. Oh, before I forget, uh, I did purchase this purchase this on Gossamer Blue for $10. They still have it on their website, so if you're really interested, I suggest you get it ASAP because um, they run out of this pretty fast. So I hope you guys enjoy this haul video and see you guys next time with part two of week four. Bye.